One of the fun things about, so I was 19 when I got pregnant, I was in university, one of the fun things about that is that you get a lot of parenting advice uh, when you're pregnant and 19, but the thing is, it's all advice from other 19 year olds, so it's terrible advice. Great example, one of my friends uh, was talking to me and I was telling her how, okay, so I wasn't sure if I was gonna keep my son or give him up for adoption, because again, I was very young and in school. And her solution to this was, you should totally keep the baby. Because then like, we can all live together in the student ghetto, in a big house. And we can throw like crazy parties. And everyone will be like, oh my god, I went to the craziest party. There was a baby there. <laughs> As if that would be a sign of a crazy party and not a sad party. I was like, no, there's no way I'm doing that at all. But there is one occasion where I would take my baby to a party, and this is it. So. We put the baby to sleep, put the baby upstairs, we don't tell anyone that there's a baby at that party. Then, we wait for the first guy to pass out. We don't draw on his face, we don't put his hands in a warm bowl of water. Instead, we change him to a nice comfy pair of PJs. We carry him upstairs, we tuck him into bed, and then I burst through the door holding the baby like, Jason, wake up, it's your turn with the baby! <laughs> You were having that dream again, weren't you? The one where you're at a university party. <laughs> Those days are over, Jason. Now get back to your job at the steam factory. <laughs> I don't have a very good concept of what a real job is like. 